Andrew McCart, IFL TV in association with MTK Global. I'm here with Stephen Simmons. Tough fight, two weeks notice. How did you feel in there, bud? I felt alright. It was just uh, me and Billy were talking about working on some stuff for we went in there. And if the stoppage came, it came. But uh, the key for me was to work on the jab and keep him, keep him at range. The only thing I, I wouldn't be doing was stepping back and coming back to the right hand. That's what we worked on in here. One, two, step back, right hand as he falls in. But, uh, he was smothering your work quite a bit in there, wasn't he? Yeah, so, he was coming in, holding on to it. Was uh, it frustrating you? Yeah. Nah, not really. Let you him get what he's got to do. The referee was aware of what he was doing. There was a like ref head, and he was aware of what he was doing. So, yeah. um, it's good to get get some rounds. I've been back in the gym for three weeks after yep. my, my little boy Ethan came along. And that, that again was two weeks notice for that fight. Well, you, you, you got the stoppage, it was a disqualification, but did yeah. you feel that stoppage was coming anyway? You were hitting with some good shots. I think these. it was coming because that round my mind was on faint with the jab left hook because he was expecting the jab. Um, so faint with the jab left hook and then I caught my peach with the left hook. So my next, my next shot was faint with the jab left hook right hand. <laughs> faint, with the, uh, faint with the jab right body. The body shots were the ones that was because it was that's how he was getting the you one. You think that's why he on. was doing that because you were frustrated with the shot you were hurting him that, yeah. Right body shot was a sink, I could hear him going. Ugh. Yeah, yeah. Well, so, you but, know me, you know me, Stephen. I, I spoke to you last time about these these type of fights. It seems like after that Germany, oh, Palabra will call it because a lot of people thought you did win that fight. You didn't really progress from that. You've had these little fights yeah, again and that. It must be frustrating for yourself because you know where you can be, and where you should be. It's uh, very frustrating. I would, I would have liked to have went with the momentum, but. Couple injuries sneaked in. Mm -hmm. uh, the the British fight, short notice. Yeah. I had a niggle in my back, came back, but that's fully gone now. So I just well, got to get back in the gym and hopefully something can get sorted sooner rather than later. So second half of the get, season. I'm sick of getting these at? offers for two weeks, three weeks. Uh -huh. I'm getting international title fight offers, and it's it's really a shit notice. How you, like, it's getting the, the mindset and the mode for that mm. for a big fight. You need to know you've got a big fight. You need to know mentally to get in that road you've got a big fight. Yeah. So to know that you've not got a fight and date and you're going out training you're like that's fucking shite. Yeah. I've been doing this for twenty one years. I need to know I've got a fight. So I've, I've uh, So let's let's look into the second half of the season, Steve, where do you want to be? Oh, I would like to be let my ask is let's go on. You've got the title. Just Hopefully our teams can talk and sort someone out. If not, I'll hopefully get a... Matt Askin, that's who you want. I'd like Matt Askin next. Uh, definitely I can take him take him out. Um, after watching that fight with Craig Kennedy, Craig Kennedy showed a lot of immaturity in that fight in his box, boxing career. His corner was telling him to move, move on to your right. Mm -hmm. He was still moving on to his left and walking on the right hand. If you caught a right hand, you, you should know to walk away from the other side. Mm -hmm. Met, you, physically, you should know that. It's, it's no rocket science, do you know what I mean? Uh, and he had plenty of notes for his fight as well. Do you so think uh, enough time, enough time, enough notice? Enough notice for me, I'll be anybody. Be anybody. Good stuff. Now, well, I appreciate you doing this for FL TV as always, Stephen, and nice I'll let you get your hands up, wrap to get showered, buddy. Right, appreciate that. Nice one.